Exactly four months ago, I started an experiment on storing eggs. I'm comparing non-refrigerated eggs, eggs that have been coated with mineral oil, refrigerated eggs, and eggs that have been vacuum sealed. These are all um, store-bought eggs, which would give the least favorable results. With the exception of the refrigerated eggs, they have been stored in my garage between 62 and 65 degrees. The first thing I want to do is put these eggs through a water test. If you put an egg in a bowl of water and it lays on the bottom, then it's fresh. If it stands up on end or bobs in the water, it's stale. And if it floats on the top, then it's rotten. Here's the non-refrigerated egg. When I put it in the water, it was actually floating. Uh, and when I cracked it open, the egg was rotten. So now we know what a rotten egg looks like. Surprisingly, it didn't smell like a rotten egg, but that's the end of the non-refrigerated eggs. All of those went into the trash. Here's the mineral oil egg, and when I put it in the water, I couldn't tell if it was still, you know, laying on the bottom of the bowl or if it was somewhat uh, bobbing or floating in the water. So I added some more water to it, and surprisingly, this egg is still like a fresh egg, and it will lay on the bottom of the bowl. Here's what it looked like when I cracked it open, and it still looks good. Here's the refrigerated egg, and it is floating. Here's what it looked like when I cracked it open. There's a dark area in the yolk. As for the vacuum sealed eggs, I only had one left, and when I looked at it the other day, the top had popped off and the egg was molded, so I threw it away. The vacuum sealed eggs don't work. So here they are side by side. This is the non-refrigerated egg, the mineral oil egg, and the refrigerated egg. Here's a view from above so that you can compare the yolks. Notice how the uh, refrigerated egg is darkening. So that's how the egg experiment is going at the four-month mark. Hope it helps.